adorable little project and never became a product of this environment, but never forgot where it came from. <laughs> he kept the ball in his hand so long as I've known him. We're talking about 42 years ago. Going back to when we were seven years old, running the hallways of the Boys and Girls Club. He had green boogers in his nose at that time. <laughs> Well, he went on to become a, to have a successful basketball game at Pulaski Middle School. <laughs> where they won a middle school championship. He went on to become a successful player and a student here at Roosevelt High School under the, <laughs> under the tutelage of Coach Ron Heffler. And if anyone can fill his shoes, and those are some big shoes to fill, I think he will. He went on to receive a full ride to the University of Little Rock, Arkansas, in basketball while juggling being a student, an athlete, a great husband, and father. To his namesake, my godson who also attended here and had a successful basketball career. But he also had six, seven other children as well, which brings me to his passion, which is children. He loved children so much, now he has a career as a therapy counselor for the adopted youth. And to tie it all together, bro, Roosevelt definitely has a winner and couldn't have made a better choice as head coach of Roosevelt Basketball Program. Your hard work, love of the kids, love of the game, and the school, along with the support of your classmates, We know you would do great things. So on behalf of your classmates, we present you your first plaque to hang on your wall. Special Award winner, great student, great coach, and one of my mentors as a coach. Also, I am humbled by the opportunity to lead such a prestigious program. Um, I've been a Panther all my life. I always bleed black and gold. And I'm going to work my tail off in order to bring this school to the championship. Back to the greatest class in the world, the class of 1980. Yeah. These ladies and gentlemen have been behind me the whole way. Last year I asked them, I said, you know, I put it on a group chat, I said, hey, my kids need shoes. You know, we're men wearing mismatched shoes. I called Monica at about 11 o'clock at night. And she said, no problem, baby, I got you. She called me back at 1 o'clock in the morning and said, the shoes will be there Friday. That's what I'm talking about. That's the class I love. That's the support that I need. And I'm going to need support from each and every girl that don't have it. Sitting in the stands, sitting at home, in the hospital, wherever you are. Come out, 
support us this year. We have a great product. We will play fast, hard, and we will play Roosevelt basketball. Back to the basics, baby. Yeah. Class of 1987, we have another presentation to make. This is Roosevelt Panther Night. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, we stand representing the class of 1987. Hey, so oh, Thank you very much. 